Hey folks, this is Akshay Dhawre and welcome to another video from Photographic. This time I have taken my Leica Q2 out to shoot in Pune and I'm very excited about the files that we've gotten back and some of the shots that I've gotten. Now, uh, we've gone to a place called Camp in Pune. Uh, it's also known as Pune Cantonment. Uh, this was uh, an area established in Pune back in the days of the British. And uh, so this was around 1817 that this cantonment was established in Pune. And it has a bunch of military uh, structures. I mean, old buildings now, they're repurposed for other things now. And um, the interesting thing is that it has a market. Uh, so there's a bit of a building, just a, a story high. So it, it's not a tall building at all. Uh, and it was established in 1885 as the marketplace uh, in Pune. Uh, it was quite an important town at the time of the British Raj and it's still functional. So it's still used as a market. Uh, there's a section that does, uh, it's like a wet market. So chicken and lamb and uh, meat and, uh, and fish. And there's a section that does uh, just fruits and vegetables. And so I'm going to be uh, walking around the Shivaji market. It's called Shivaji market, by the way. And uh, I'm, I've taken some shots inside the market as well, uh, and also some shots around the market. And I'm really excited about this. Uh, I had my friend with me who was shooting me, taking a video footage of me taking the pictures. And so we have a little bit of a walk around with the Leica and a few pictures, a few techniques uh, that I use when I do street photography. And we can talk about that at the end of the video. All right, see you on the other side. Bye.
sir, we can shoot if we want to. All right, folks, I hope you enjoyed that. I certainly did. There's always a lot happening around Shivaji Market. And so it's a nice place to do some street photography. What I want to do in the next video is take a few of these shots or maybe new ones that I create. And I want to talk a little bit about the technique behind those shots. And then I want to dive a little deeper into what in the Leica Q2 lets me create those kind of shots or helps me uh, with those kind of shots. So I'll see you in the next one. Until then, bye.